going on everybody it's october 31st aka vlogtober 31st last day of vlogtober trying to finish strong today we're heading out to ankeny which is about 10 miles away from des moines and there's a place there called carney marsh preserve where there's a trail that i'm supposed to be able to get my three miles in on we haven't ever been there before so we'll see how that is hopefully it's a good one after i'm done running we're gonna do a little bit of shopping hit a few stores see if i can get a new pair of running shoes number one but we need a few grocery items as well i'm gonna take you guys along with me let's go all right we've made it to carney marsh nature preserve the trail goes a couple different directions if i go that way it's back towards des moines if i go this way it's towards uh looks like aura labar i don't know if i'm saying that right but that's, anyway, I think we're gonna run this way and see where this trail goes. I was hoping it went around the actual marsh, but so far I'm not seeing any way to, uh, to get around it. So I may have to just run over here just to get a shot of the marsh. All right, made it down by the water. There's supposed to be all kinds of wildlife in this thing, but being that it's, you know, in getting to the colder season, we're probably not gonna see too many snapping turtles or painted turtles or uh, anything like that, so I don't have my hopes up too high, but I wanted to get a shot of the water regardless All right, here we go run streak day 28 5k streak number 25 We um, we are gonna keep the pace super slow today. Maybe not like 10 minutes, but I'm aiming for like a 930 mile pace something pretty slow that's gonna let my legs not necessarily have a rest day, but somewhat of a rest day anyway being that we're getting deeper into this 5k streak I don't want to jeopardize you know an injury or something right at the end where I'm trying to reach you know 30 days of doing a 5k so taking it easy taking my time Inga's back at the truck waiting listening to her audiobook so there's no rush today trail so far is nice though I don't usually hold the camera with my uh, right hand. I don't know if anybody notices that. I always hold it with my left for a couple reasons. Number one, it's more comfortable. Number two, for whatever reason, I don't know what it is, the audio sounds better when I hold it over here on this side. We'll see if there's a difference in this video here. Microphone check, microphone check. Now over here. Microphone check, microphone check. Is there a difference? So I was thinking yesterday, Vlogtober coming to an end. I don't know how I wanna proceed with the videos. Um, there's a couple ways I can go about it. Because I'm going to be keeping the streak going, obviously. But do I want to take like a week's worth of footage, compile it into one video a week, or do maybe two to three videos a week? Or do I want to keep with the uh, daily vlogs and just keep them really short, like two, three minutes? Make them a little more short and to the point and less of me rambling while I'm running. What do you guys think? Post a comment below. What do you think I should do? Should I continue with the daily vlogs? Should I maybe do two or three videos a week? My idea with the uh, keeping in the daily vlogs was, you know, the daily vlogs would literally just be running related. Just show a little bit of running footage, maybe recapping the run and, you know, recapping how the streak is going and mileage per week, blah, 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 blah all that stuff and then I can still do some uh, like recipe videos and stuff like that but they would just be separate maybe I would release those on the weekend and then continue the daily vlogs throughout the week looks like we got a split in the trail here I think I'm gonna head to the left go up to this bridge
Okay, so there's a road that we're about to come to here and I'm gonna stop here because I'll be, once I reach the road, right at uh, 1.5 miles. But on the way back, there was a little, I think it was like 0.3 mile offshoot to a separate park. And I figure I'll incorporate that into my run. That way I can ensure I'm just over 5K and go check out a new park. All right, we're turning around. Mile 1.54. Forget the name of the park. We'll see when we get there. All right, I've been shooting videos all morning and I haven't even mentioned the fact that it's Halloween today. Happy Halloween, everybody. Don't know if everybody watching this video celebrates Halloween. I mean, we sort of do, Inga and I. Our daughters are all older and living on their own. So we don't celebrate it with our kids, obviously. But we decorate the apartment up a little bit. Last night was beggars night i don't know if that's just an iowa thing or a midwest thing or what but it's basically like the night before halloween is beggars night we didn't get anybody i was thinking maybe a couple kids from the apartment complex at least might stop through but new no. Okay, Springwood Park this way. Here we go. Well, we uh, reached the end of the road here. The road that it told me to go down to get to Springwood Park. And I see no park. It's just a cul-de-sac. So I don't know where the park is. I don't know what they're talking about. Either way, it's a nice neighborhood to run through. So I'm heading back to the truck at this point. Otherwise, uh, there's mile three. So otherwise I'm gonna be going over my uh, distance for the day. Okay, we're back on the Gay Leah Wilson Trail. You can pretty much always tell it's a Monday when you're out running and uh, nobody waves back at you. <laughs> I mean, it's not gonna stop me from doing it. But uh, I don't know what it is. I guess people just hate Mondays so much that their uh, friendliness and courtesy just kind of goes out the window. That's okay. We don't let that affect us. Stopping here, it looks like there's a little path where I can get to this other side. Because the water we were at before, the marsh area was over there. There's a different one. Let's see if we could spot any turtles. Ooh, I did see something just dive under the water there. Might have been a turtle. Some mallards and some geese hanging out over here. All right, we've made it back to Kearney Marsh. Let me stop my watch here. Okay, so we made it back to the truck. Four miles, so we did do a mile over what we intended, but that's okay. We were doing like a really slow pace, so our legs are still feeling like ultra good at this point. We're gonna get in the truck, go do a little bit of shopping. All right, so we're back at home now. It was a long day of shopping, and we're pretty hungry, so we're making our dinner tonight. Our Halloween dinner is going to be these uh, Amy's pizzas, we're each gonna eat one of these, but we uh, kind of made it our own. We put a little bit of these field roast pepperoni slices on there, and then some pineapple as well. So it should be really good. Okay, so dinner's done. Here's our Amy's pizza with the field roast pepperoni and some pineapple on there. It's looking really good. Although I'm thinking that maybe they changed the recipe for the Amy's pizza a little bit, because the, the color on it looks a little bit different than usual. It's been a while since we've eaten it though. All right, so before I end this Vlogtober 31st video, I just wanted to show you what I ended up picking up at Kohl's. I was successful in finding a new pair of ASICs over there. These are the ASICs Trail Scout 2s. I paid 45 bucks for them, which originally I actually thought was a pretty good deal. 
But it turns out if you go to the ASICS website, and I think even on Amazon, you can pick these up for $39.99 right now. So I actually paid $5 more than that, but that's okay. No big deal. They uh, look pretty nice. They're pretty comfy when I tried them on. So pretty lightweight for trail running shoes. So I'll give these guys a shot here probably later in the week. Maybe, uh, maybe not tomorrow, but maybe the day after that. All right, guys. Well, I'm going to end the video there. We're going to go ahead and end Vlogtober at this point. It's been a good month. We've made a lot of videos. We've ran a lot of miles. We've uh, definitely followed a lot of new channels and got to check out some new content on YouTube, which has been great. I was gonna do a shout outs uh, session in today's video, but just never had the time, didn't get around to it. And I don't really wanna release another 15 to 17 minute video, so I'm trying to keep it a little bit shorter. But I definitely appreciate everybody watching all my videos throughout Vlogtober, it's been fantastic. Well, thank you for watching everybody. Hit the like button if you like this video and you wanna see the run streak continue. Hit the subscribe button if you're not yet subscribed and you wanna support this channel. Ring the notification bell if you want to be notified whenever I drop a new video. Until tomorrow, everybody. Take care.